back to the channel guys crypto lights here we're back again with another video and today i want to talk about the graph grt we talked about this yesterday and i also want to talk a little bit about moon day and moon farm i want to address what's happening there uh, because people are asking questions and stuff like that um i might as well start by kicking off with moon day all right so of course i promoted the pre-sale for moon day i actually got in on the pre-sale for sorry moon farm moon farm um if you guys have been watching the videos you know that i also bought moon farm tokens and i was in on that pre-sale all right guys and we're actually on the moon day chart not the moon farm chart at the moment but um what's happened with moon day all right people are asking me if i got paid for this and that you know um in the previous video that i made for moon day um uh, it does let you know there was a paid promotion as do all of my paid videos all right however i've done videos before for you know moon day moon farm several videos over all their projects um i did videos on moon day on the moon day project i did videos on the moon gold project um, i had no reason to believe that there was any foul play with the moon farm project all right so i was happy to do another video for moon farm and promote the pre-sale now every uh, video that i did uh, pushing the pre-sale wasn't sponsored okay obviously because i was in the pre-sale myself and because i had uh, made people aware of the pre-sale obviously i was reminding people that the pre-sale was there however you know when it came out after pre-sale moon farm landed there were some issues with the contract there was a bug or, or so they say and then what they did is they issued a new contract and i got airdropped to my new moon farm tokens and i actually sold those tokens after that happened all right guys so now we see that Moon Day has uh, kind of fallen off and the talk in the groups is that the founder has sold his tokens which is what caused it to go down. Now, I don't know any, what, what the truth is or anything like that but I can look at the chart and see that it's gone all the way down from around $700 down to $40 alright. So someone say that's a rug pull um if i look on the um on the uh, uh uniswap um it says there's thirty two thousand in liquidity in there still all right guys and people are still being able to execute their trades um so you know i don't think the liquidity has been pulled out or the liquidity was drained but a lot of tokens were sold which has caused the price to go down now obviously um it is a little bit annoying if you're an investor in that me personally i won't hold in anything but yeah, it's, it's a bit sad to see uh, something like that happen because when you have a low liquidity token and you sell lots of coins, that's not going to be good for investors. All right. If you've got a high liquidity token, if you know like what happened with uh, a Litecoin back in the day, the founder of Litecoin, he kind of predicted it was going to be a two year bear market and he sold all of his tokens. You know, he didn't hide away from that. He did it, all right, guys, but that didn't kill Litecoin. Litecoin survived, um, and, and of course, Litecoin was was in a bear market, right? It was in a bear. It was the beginning of the bear market. He sold his tokens, all right, but it's frowned upon for a founder of a project or a big bag holder that's part of the team to kind of sell loads of their tokens because that's basically going to drain the liquidity, all right, guys. So I mean, I can only apologise to you if you you know um, if if you've lost money. And I'm, I'm not apologising because anything I've done just apologising for the simple fact that you know what uh, it's very hard in DeFi sometimes, and um, there's a lot of rug pulls, and you don't know who to trust. The only thing that I would say is uh, it's good to know who's beyond a project, you know, because you, who do you hold accountable for when something like this happens, you know? Some people will debate whether it's, you know, whether someone's done something wrong by selling their tokens. I mean, people have to pay their bills, right? I think it's just the way that you do it. Um, the way that you do it is uh, frowned upon. Um, it's not something that I'm looking to do with Bubble Network, you know, so anyone pointing the finger thinking, you know, uh, you know, I've had negative comments uh, because of this, right? Um, people are asking me, did you get paid for this? Or did you get paid off for that? youtubers they just want to scam you and promote this and that i mean how are you supposed to know that something like this is going to happen but yeah um that's really all i can say about it um, i haven't spoken to the founder um i did speak to him um days ago about unrelated issues but since then the account has been deleted which doesn't look good all right guys but that's really all i can say about moon day moon farm obviously this will be my final video on moon day and moon farm uh, but i just wanted to address this for anyone that might have any questions um hopefully i've answered them moving on to grt all right so grt uh the graph 
Okay, we talked about the graph in yesterday's video. All right, guys, I thought that it had a high chance of going up. What I actually didn't know is um, after I got off the video, I noticed that it had been announced that the graph or GRT was now on Coinbase. All right, guys, so for me, that was a confirmation that this thing was going to pump at least a little bit. Okay, so since we talked about it yesterday, let's see where it was. It was around this area with the big wick. All right, so over here. Okay, so since we spoke about it in yesterday's video, it has gone up another 83% approximately. So if you did get in after that, congratulations, you would have made some money on the graph. It's always good when there's a legit project that, you know, I mean, it's got a, a, a good reputation. I mean, they partnered with Chainlink, we know. They're integrated with Chainlink, and they're on Coinbase now. I haven't checked, but people said that they were on Binance. And obviously, we've seen, uh, you know, overnight for me, we've seen this go up significantly, okay? 83% is not a bad start. Very high liquidity on the graph, 3.2 million at the moment. I mean, definitely a good one uh, to hold for the long term, in my opinion. Or at least it appears that way at the moment. But we do have alt season approaching, and um, who knows how well this can perform. Okay. Before we close the video, I want to talk to you about WISE. And WISE is now up to 43,482 Ethereum. Now, I'm quite happy to promote this pre-sale because I do trust the founder, uh, not because I know him or anything like that, but I can see his face. He's doing daily live streams. All right, guys, um, this is ownerless liquidity. Uh, the contract has been audited and it passed. Uh, there's all sorts that's right with this project. People compare it to Hex. All right, um, I didn't know much about Hex. I know they went to the moon. I know that people made a lot of money. I mean, even someone in my Telegram group told me how he made like 100x on Hex. And this reminds him of Hex. Always good to know, um, you know, something that, uh, that uh, reminds you of something that, 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 that did completely well. Um, for me, this is definitely where I've been storing my Ethereum in Wise. All right, guys, I'm going to leave a link in the description, my referral link, so you can get 10% extra if you do by wise i've referred quite a lot of people to wise i've always been open and transparent about that it's one of the best ways to earn extra money with wise or extra ethereum or extra wise tokens all right to date i've referred 133 referrals 173 ethereum now that's not bad <laughs> that's a lot of ethereum that i've referred all right, guys, and I actually get 10% at that part for doing that. And you get 10% once you reach past 50 referrals. Oh, no, sorry, 50 Ethereum worth of referrals. All right, so that could be a good pre-sale for you to get into. At least you can trust that one. Uh, you know that the owners are not going to dump tokens because they didn't have tokens. Any tokens that they are going to have uh, are bought uh, through the same method that we buy them um, on the reservation pools. All right. Yesterday's reservation didn't. Uh, it was an orange day. Okay, it didn't exceed the five million, but it wasn't uh, too far. Uh, four point four million. All right, guys. So, if you were in on yesterday's reservation day, as I was, my share was only seven hundred and twenty wise, as opposed to the previous day, five thousand one hundred and thirty wise. However, I had much more Ethereum in on that day, and I've also put another one Ethereum into. Uh, this day because I put the most into the green days in my opinion I don't put wise I don't put uh, ethereum into the red days all right that's just my preference I'm not a gambling man all right guys I like to know exactly what I'm getting or, or know that I'm going to get something out of it because if one wise gets shared out you know you basically lost money all right guys so that is about it for now remember I'll leave my link in the description for you so you can go and reserve your wise get 10% extra on that. I will also get 10%. All right. And then you can generate your own referral link and start referring people as well. All right, guys. So if you've not smashed the like button, make sure you do that. Also, subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you guys in the next video.